Huhu. I wanted to tell you about what coincidence yesterday happened to me. Sometimes the reality just fits into what you're writing. And I love those happenings. I wrote about the earthling information to the background. I'm writing the novel Onti Tolls the VRMMORPG. So it's about uh, players who enter a game, a virtual reality game. And um, in similar books, the players get from the native populations, the NPCs, a name. Yeah? Like, uh, oh, these are these crazy travelers, <laughs> or immortals, or... Um, Aliens or travelers is pretty common. So in my book, uh, the players called Earthlings. And in this world, there are firelings, waterlings, metallings. In the backstory, the Earthlings left the world, but now they came back um, as players. I'm an Earthling. <laughs> the name is because... We are from the planet Earth, and um, all humans, or nearly all humans, have Earth colors from uh, very light limestone uh, like colors to um, dark brown, mother earthy colors. So the firelings and the wood, the firelings are a red, yellow, blue, a bit of blue. The especially hot ones. The waterlings are mainly bluish or greenish. So I made a logo for the earthing information. This is a kind of tourist information for the players. They can find a quest there, information about the zone. Um, you can, if you have a business, you can register it there. Uh, there are blackboards looking for group people who want to sell their wares, uh, etc. Yeah, you can say like a, a tourist information uh, with everything. Everything a tourist information contains, including ticket sales for events and similar things. I made a logo for it and uh, I thought, ah, let's do some kind of throwback. I don't know if throwback is the right wo word. Kind of quotation of old games like World of Warcraft, where the quest givers have a yellow exclamation mark above their heads. So, uh, because you can uh, get quests at the uh, Earthling information, I thought, let's integrate a yellow exclamation mark and a logo. I did this, but uh, I wasn't completely satisfied with the logo. I'm still not completely satisfied with the logo. I searched for uh, symbols to enhance the logo, symbols about Earth. Kanji for Earth, uh, the Japanese, and um, in Europe, the alchemists had uh, symbols for the elements as well. So I looked at uh, the alchemist symbols and found uh, the one for Earth. It's um, an inverted uh, pyramid uh, with a line through it. And I thought, nice enough, yeah. Scrolled down. And then found this. And it looks like a qu like a exclamation mark. I mean, how cool is this? That the symbol for Earth looks like an exclamation mark, which is the gamer symbol for quest going. Ah, oh, I'm loving it. Is this trademark by McDonald's? I like it very, very much. <laughs> that kind of coincidence when different parts of your story come together per happenstance, but it makes me feel really 
like the story works, like I'm part of something deeper. <laughs> okay, that's a bit silly, but uh, yeah, I'm stoked and I thought I share it, visit the Earth information and get some quests. Bye-bye.